Hi, beautiful people. Welcome back to Learn with Mnet, the place where we learn, create, and grow together. Have you ever thought of starting a faceless YouTube channel but felt too shy to show your face? Or maybe you don't have the equipment to film yourself. Well, you're in the right place. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to transform a simple photo into a fully animated character that speaks and gestures naturally. This is perfect for storytelling, podcast, motivational talks, tutorials, AI content, 3D animations, and so much more. The best part? Once you've created your avatar, you can keep reusing it for new projects. Just update the lip sync, change outfits, hairstyles, or even switch up the studio background to keep things fresh. Pretty exciting, right? Let's dive in. Step one, choose your photo. Start with a clear photo of yourself facing the camera. If you don't want to use your own, you can generate one with AI inside ChatGPT. Step two, build your prompt with reference images. If you want your avatar to wear a specific outfit or appear in a particular studio, just like the two images you see on screen, here's how to do it. I'll upload the studio image into ChatGPT and ask it to describe it in detail. That description becomes part of my prompt. Next, I'll upload the outfit image and do the same. ChatGPT will describe details like hairstyle, makeup, outfit, and even background settings. I'll then copy only the parts I want and add them to my document. By combining both descriptions, outfit plus studio, your AI knows exactly how to style your avatar, including accessories and overall look. And if you're short on ideas, don't worry. I've made a full video on where to find inspiration for styling avatars and studios. Check the pinned comment. Step three. Refine and generate your avatar. After editing your prompt, paste it back into ChatGPT and ask it to refine it for better results. Then upload your photo, paste the prompt, and generate your avatar. If the first result isn't what you want, no problem. Just regenerate until you're satisfied. Step four, animate your avatar. There are many animation platforms out there, like Kling, Runway ML, Vidu2 AI, Pixverse, and D3ID. But in this tutorial, we'll use Google AI Studio, VO2. It's simple, professional, and doesn't require credits. Don't let your avatar repeat the same gestures. To add variety, Ask ChatGPT to write multiple animation prompts. For example, animate avatar speaking with natural hand gestures, or animate avatar in the Neon Podcast Studio with a blinking YouTube play button. Sign up for Google AI Studio with your Google account. Then click Generate Media, select VO, upload your image, paste the prompt, and hit Run. The first animation looked great, but the second one, with a different prompt, came out even better. The movements and gestures were completely different, and the YouTube play button was blinking too. That's why I generated up to six versions, so my avatar wouldn't feel repetitive. Each one looked unique, stylish, and realistic. Step five, edit before lip sync. Here's a step many people miss. Let's say your animation is eight seconds long, but your voiceover is 30 seconds. Lip sync tools like Dreamface will loop the same eight seconds until it fills the 30 seconds, which doesn't look natural. To fix this, first bring all your animated clips into an editor like CapCut. Trim out unwanted parts and combine them until the video length matches your audio. Step six, lip sync your avatar. Now it's time to bring your avatar to life. On mobile, you can use Dreamface. 
On desktop, Sync.so is fantastic. It gives free lip syncs each month and it doesn't leave bold watermarks. Just upload your video and audio, sync them, and download your clip. Now you know how to transform your own photo into an animated character. Just like me, speaking and making natural gestures with confidence. Now your avatar speaks naturally. Step 7. Use your avatar in thumbnails. You can even use your avatar for thumbnails. Simply upload it into ChatGPT and say, use the uploaded image as the main character in this thumbnail. Keep the avatar ultra-realistic or 3D with the wow or surprised expression. Then add your thumbnail details. And that's it. Now you know how to transform your own photo into an animated character. Just like me, speaking and making natural gestures with confidence. You can use for videos, shorts, podcasts, and thumbnails. Which niche are you planning to start with? Storytelling, tutorials, or podcast? Let me know in the comments. If this video gave you value, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more step-by-step -step tutorials. And don't forget to hit the bell so you never miss my next video. Thanks so much for watching, my friends. Until next time, keep creating with AI and keep shining online.